Wouldn't you like to know who is the gatekeeper of these infinite worlds? Am I the Graysu God, or some form of artificial intelligence? A psychological experiment in which you're the guinea pig? Yeah. What is going on, guys? UTC here, back in your life with some Californium. And this game has been very weird. We have peeled back the layers of reality to reveal an alternate reality, which we are then peeled back the layers of to reveal a further alternate reality represented by this and this and whoa and the whole time we're just seeing symbols out uh, we click on them and the world changes just parts of it melt away and are replaced with parts from a different time space continuum okay okay uh, let's peek there was a TV by this diner how many symbols are left on it one I think we have one symbol to find and it's out in the giant size of the city they've all been huge like Abe Lincoln was replaced by a symbol you saw the size of that last one so it's got to be here it's got to be this place doesn't it one of these remaining buildings is just gonna get swallowed up and replaced by uh, a different one this one's already filled with robots it's weird like, what the hell is that thing? Look at its face. It's, it's a weird place. I have no idea what future we're headed to. Help me find this damn symbol. Rolling Dice Diner, where are you gonna be? Here, this building. Yeah, right, I forgot about this. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's you starting to look like much, California you, again. Elvin, my boy. Wouldn't you like to know who is the gatekeeper of these infinite worlds? Am I the Graysu God, or some form of artificial intelligence? A psychological experiment in which you're the guinea pig? Yeah. Am I the manifestation of a temporal epileptic fit affecting your brain? I... I suppose it could be. Even I don't know. I simply deliver my reports. But I am neither your tutor nor your nanny. Huh. I am not your Virgil, and you are certainly not Dante. And we are definitely not in paradise. It certainly doesn't seem like it. So what the hell awaits us now? Last time I'd done this many symbols, that giant triangle uh, of light appeared and uh, whoa. and uh, I changed my positioning so that uh, I lined up with it maybe it has to do with this drill or maybe there's another building uh, with symbols is there another one you can go in I suppose my apartment could be filled with that kind of stuff yeah I mean he was talking about uh, Dante's Inferno and the seven circles of hell, right? Is there another TV here? I think I hear one. I think I hear one. Yep. Here we go. One more in this strange place at least. Four. Well, first one's quite obvious. There. Here. Oh, it's reversed. Earth in our minds, Mars in our hearts. MMC. Lincoln. Automaton. This. Oh, we're jumping even further into the future? Okay, let's look around. Let's see what we can uncover about it. Yes. Move. Disappear. Go away. Reveal a Omega symbol. Maybe not. Yes. It's a bookshelf with trophies 
And is that a human spine? No, maybe it's a laurel. Okay. Dynamite? No. Those are weird glass slides. Okay. I don't un even understand the future we're headed to. I don't know anything about it yet. My apartment's certainly different as hell. And there's certainly not as much crap about a Blinken. He's starting to look like a robot and not anything else. Come on, Link. There. Whoa. Oh, I should have saved this one for last. It's so cool. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, we'll come back out here when he does his speech for the most exciting moment. How many more? Uh, at least a couple more. Let's look around. There you are, you little cutie. Another bookshelf. Just abstract, super abstract stuff now. I mean, are those torpedoes? What the hell is this? Is that part of my futuristic bed? All right, let's find the last one of these. It's gotta be in the bathroom, right? Is there a couple? There might be a couple left. I guess I just gotta keep moving around until all this stuff, yeah, there you go. What? Oh, if I look at it, it disappears? Yeah. Weird. Weird. They're all little mini games. I don't like future bathrooms. Uh, how many left? How many are left? One. There's one left. You gotta be in this corner. You gotta be in this corner or in the closet somewhere over here, right? There, closet it is. Come on. Whoa. Oh, uh. I think I'm just walking through walls at this point. Come on, there's a damn symbol here. I saw the light flash. Okay. I'll back right away. There. If I'm moving and far away? Why, why did that appear there? Where is it? I can't see the actual symbol. There. Uh-huh. All right. But surely Speak the real to me. question is, who are you, Elden Green? I sense a sort of split in your personality. Right. Like a transversal okay. communication. It's back. Well, of course, some of the symptoms are clear enough for a straightforward diagnosis. Schizophrenia, agoraphobia, paranoia. But Yep. I perceive another presence. Drugs. As if your psyche were spun from a host of malignant forces. Uh-huh. Uh, we just have to line this up, make it look like uh, it all lines up, which it will do if I just keep, yeah, adjusting my, no, up, up here. Oh, wow. Guys, this game has been intense and weird so far. I, uh, I wasn't sure what I was in for with, uh, Californium, but it's impressed. Uh, I love games with cheeky narrators, and I think, I think we found the exact spot we needed to stand. What the hell world is waiting for us up ahead? Guys, why don't we call this episode here? Thank you so much for watching this one. I will be back with more Californium in the next episode. TV. The TV. That's what's making all the noise. That's Omega? It looks like it's the end of the line for you, Mr. Green. Wow. Narrator comes into the game. Writer's block. 
A brain corroded by mind-bending drugs and dime store alcohol. Wow. The woman of your dreams and your little girl. No more than distant memories. <laughs>